Have you ever wondered how Colorado's highways and bridges are managed, maintained, and replaced? CDOT's new asset management plan tells you all of that and more. CDOT maintains 23,000 miles of highways and over 3,000 bridges statewide. That's a lot of infrastructure. To help us take care of it all, we've developed a comprehensive plan for the next 10 years. So, what exactly is in our asset management plan? Well, it focuses on 12 asset types. In addition to pavement and bridges, we manage maintenance buildings, culverts, snow plows and other fleet, geohazards, rest areas, traffic signals, tunnels, and more. It's a big job, but one we take seriously. If you're short on time, our executive summary tells you everything you need to know in just 11 pages. You'll learn about how many assets we have, the current condition of roads, bridges, tunnels, and other assets, our anticipated financial needs, and the top risks to our assets like flood and fire. CDOT invests a large portion of its budget into taking care of these assets, nearly $800 million a year. However, the department still faces a yearly shortfall of about $350 million to meet its performance targets. Reading the executive summary will tell you all of that. And if you're looking for extra credit, there's just short of 300 more pages to dive into with discussions of asset valuations, asset modeling tools, and other details. So why is the TAMP important for you and other Coloradans? By having a solid plan in place, CDOT can prioritize its investments to maximize the longevity and efficiency of the state's transportation assets for the least amount of money. In practice, this means repairing or replacing the right road or bridge at the right time. By maximizing investments in this way, Colorado residents and visitors can enjoy safer and smoother roads and bridges for years to come.